What's up gamers, Res here, and today we're playing Wings of Blue Star. Wings of Blue Star is a bullet hell shmup uh, with featuring hand-drawn graphics. The developer is Shinu Real Arts, as you can see right there. And it's a pretty cool game, and I kind of want to show it to you real quick. Sorry about the glitching. The game, I couldn't update my copy of the game, so... Um, this, this is something the developer is working on getting rid of, and we're just going to jump right into the game right here. So there's a story mode and an arcade mode. We're going to do arcade so mode because the story character. mode is uh, just, it would just take too long for this to show here. You have an option of picking as you pick either mode. The uh, gameplay is the same. So as you pick either arcade mode or story mode, you can pick with the uh, cute anime girl, Aya, or this dude, Zarak, Zarek. I'm not sure how to pronounce it. I always pick the cute anime girl because I would not. Alright. So, well, let's get started. How cool is this? Come in, pilot Aya. Enemy presence ahead. Just remember, it's good luck. Okay, so a really cool kind of uh, early 90s uh, shmup kind of start th starting thing. Really cool music too. Uh, so Shino Real Arts is basically a two-person game studio. One person whom I follow on Twitter oops, handles the graphics, the gameplay, everything, and another person does the actual sound of the... With, uh, um, what their name is, what their Twitter is, but I will put the Twitter handle of Shin Real Arts in the description so you can follow them after this. So one thing you notice right away is the graphics are really, really, really nice. Uh, everything's hand drawn, and it just looks cool. Later levels will have a really cool graphical effect which you're not going to see here. I only want to do like, the first two levels. Oof, man, I'm hurting already. I'm not good at schmucks, so I just want to point that out. Especially not bullet hell schmucks, so we're gonna see me die a lot. I'm using a Super Nintendo replica controller to play this. Uh, it kind of feels appropriate, plus it's easier to play. Whoa, whoa. Ah, got me. Yeah, I'm pretty terrible. Let's continue. Last time I played, uh, I was I played better than this. This is uh, kind of embarrassing. Okay, got a danger coming from the sides. Whoa. Okay. I was using the D-pad. I just switched over to the analog stick. Maybe I'll have a better look at that. There we go. Oh my goodness. Like I said, pull it out. I don't know how I just looked through that. Yeah. We're gonna be continuing again very soon. So I was planning on showing you guys the first two levels. I wonder if we're gonna make it to the end of the first level. But please continue to gaze on the amazing level too. Oh, so, uh, just to give you a quick idea of the story, since we're not doing story mode, basically it's all about uh, this kind of like futuristic planet or colony, I'm not 100% sure on that, but it's populated by humans and they discover a uh, kind of an ancient artificial intelligence that helps advance society, but eventually takes over and they're fighting against that artificial intelligence and its weapons and its supporters. So that's what we're kind of what we're doing right now. The cutscenes are all stills um, with text in the bottom. Oh, we'll continue to that. And they're well drawn, and the story's interesting. It's just it's extremely involved. Like, oh my goodness. It'll probably take uh, 20 minutes to go through all that. And we're only going to take Let's see if I can do this without embarrassing myself. Like, I can't be released, make it to the end of the level, beat the boss uh, without running out of continues. We'll see. I'm not hopeful right now. I got through it. The bullets move slowly enough on the default difficulty you can get through. Here we go, the boss. Alright. The miracle never sees. Alright, here we go. 
I just noticed the boss time. I didn't notice that the last time I fought this guy. So I guess we had uh, about two minutes to beat this dude. It should be more than enough time. There we go. First shield down. Uh, do I have enough lives left? Uh, let's find out. Come on. Let's go through this. Oh, the waves, the waves. Got through it, got through that one. I have one more continue. I love how the game tells me to get serious. That's uh, from that's a callback to Blazing Star. It's one of my favorite shmups in the movie. There, when you died, there would be an officer to ask me, Come on, are you serious? Am I serious? No, apparently not. It took all the continues in the world for me to. Oh, I thought I won. Oh, whoops. I did not win at all. I'm not even looking at the boss, I'm just looking at these bullets right now. See where is the path. I think I got it. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. That was close. Am I even hitting him? I definitely need that. Okay, so how many continues is that? Five? Six? I know, you're not impressed. I'm not either. I'm impressed by the game. I'm not impressed by my own skill, though. Pat him a bonus? Not sure who that is. Pop idol or something. <sighs> Man, that was embarrassing. You can use your shield as a combo tool. Well, that's great. Uh, I just got an, uh, an achievement that says get good, bro. Yeah, I, I, I do need to. There's a rotating turret in this game where you can rotate the angle on the turret using the shoulder buttons. You will never see it because I just died. Huh. Okay. So, as you can see, uh, that's my name. That's the difficulty level. That's my max combo. Boss for high score 0. Arkham more high score 86,000 points. You know, I'm going to call it a day right here just because I'm so bad at this game and I'm bad at shmups in general. I just wanted to show you the game. The game is really cool. So again, it's Wings of Blue Star by Shinra Real Arts. Uh, go check it out on Steam. It's cheap. It's great. It's a lot of fun. Leave them a review. Follow the dev on Twitter. Um, don't let my horrible gaming distract you from getting it because it's a great game. I'm just bad at it. And uh, make sure to follow the, the developer because they're making a, an, action, um, an action platformer as their next project and it looks really cool. So go follow them and until next time, Res out.